and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do an update for my For the Love of Panning collaboration. I have with uh, five other ladies, I believe. Amber from Amber F, Catherine from Catherine Pie, Jamie from Jamie Jinx, and Betsy from Make Up Your Mind. And the creator of this collaboration, Rebecca from Simple Start and Go. There are some other ladies that have joined us in this collab. Rebecca has made an entire playlist of all the videos here on YouTube that are in this collab, so I will link the playlist down below. So I hope you have seen the intro and first update for this project, otherwise I will have them linked down below if you want to check them out first before watching this video. Just to clarify this project, this started at February 1st and it will end on April 22nd, I believe, which is a day. We have chosen seven products. I have one empty this time and I'm very excited about this one. And then we have six remaining items. For my empty, I have finished a lip gloss and this is very, very exciting progress. The marks are not very opaque anymore, but I started with the project up here and then my first update and now I have finished it. There is the tiniest bit left here on the bottom but I can't reach it even though I have stored it upside down for the whole weekend. I got one application <laughs> yesterday. So I did remove the stopper so I tried to get the last bit out but I couldn't. I'm not the biggest lip gloss person so I won't buy any more lip glosses but this was an Okay, lip gloss considered. I don't like lip glosses. It was a sheer pink lip gloss from Rebel London and it is their Stay Glossy Lip Gloss in Non-Stop Glamour. So this was a very nice gloss, but yeah, again, I, I won't buy it again. Then for my lip pencil from Only Cosmetics, it is a light pink shade that I used with the lip gloss sometimes. And I made very consistent Progress. I can't find my mark here. Here are my progress lines. The top line is where I started and first update and second update, which is now. So I have made very consistent progress, I think. And I'm very excited about that because I don't use lip liner on a regular basis. But I don't know if I'm going to finish this in a month or is it like 20 days or so? Then I have my Benefit the Professional tiny sample. I started here, first update, and now I'm kind of at the same mark, but I'm kind of bending it a bit further. So I just couldn't make a mark, but I'm almost done. So I'm pretty sure I can finish this by the finale, which is next update. So I hope I can. I want it so bad to be gone because I do have a backup of this and I quite like it. This highlighter blush from my C palette, I did hit pan on it last time and that was my goal. And I just tried to keep using it. So I have my progress here. I will try to insert a picture so you could see what it looked like last time. But I have expanded the pan a bit. So yeah, I will try to use this up this year, so I will just keep using it until it's gone, basically. So I will just swatch it real quick. I do use it like as a top uh, blush topper because it's kind of too dark for me as a um, highlight itself. So I will use it as a top blush topper and it's very pretty for that. Then we have my Maybelline Color 2 in on and on bronze i have made okay progress on this i'm kind of disappointed i haven't got more progress on it but yeah this is where i am now i hope i can finish this by the next update i really hope so i want it to be gone so bad so i can work on another color too this is just where i am i'm quite excited about it being gone soon but I'm not that patient <laughs> about it. And for my nail polish from Nils Jorn, the Danish brand, I have a mark this time. I'm very excited about this mark because last time I didn't have a mark. So yeah, this is why I, um, I know for a fact I can't finish this in the next 20 days. But yeah, it is what it is and I quite like 
this polish so i'm not in a rush to finish it or anything then we have my lip scrub from lush in the scent or taste bubblegum i love this product and i have been loving it more when i use it in my shower so this is why um i have a ton of product left but this was completely full when i started this project too months ago so i'm quite excited to be this far with the product i don't know if you can see it in the photos but i'm quite far down i'm about here so i guess i was up with this edge last time and now i'm below it i'm using this every other day when i shower so yeah it is going and i'm very happy that i found a use for it and it's not just sitting there dried up that was everything for this update i hope you enjoyed and i hope you will check out all the other ladies down below in my description box and thanks for all the ladies who have joined this collab it has been so much fun to watch you all so i hope you will subscribe to me and follow my social media my links are down below and linked here on the screen so you can see it i have a new project pain coming up very soon and a lot of products i need to update you on in the next couple of weeks i hope you will stay tuned for those videos as i said i hope you will check out the other ladies down below and yeah i hope you are doing well until my next video